Brianna. Thank you, Drew. And it is Easter Sunday, so it might seem fitting to buy a bunny for your kids, but a local rabbit rescuer says as cute as they might be, you want, might want to think twice before bringing one home. Tonight, a Spokane woman says some parents go a little overboard this time of the year and end up making a choice they might regret. KXLY 4's Taylor Graham has the story and the advice you'll only see on KXLY. Taylor. Well, Tracy Martin says she's seen it time and time again, especially around Easter Sunday. Parents buy their kids their own Easter bunnies, thinking it'll be a cute gift without considering just how much care these animals require. Come on, Noodles. Come here. I didn't start out to be the crazy rabbit lady. I just became one. And she wouldn't have it any other way. Come on, Dar. Good girl. Come when she's not teaching others how to care for their rabbits, oh, you're just adorable. Spokane self proclaimed crazy rabbit lady Tracy Martin spends her days with hers, Canoodle. You little white toes and your little white nose. And 13 others. Oh, no, no. <laughs> that spend their days roaming through their own houses in Tracy's backyard. It's a little. Bunny village back here. It hasn't always been like this. Tracy started out with one bunny, but didn't exactly know how to care for it. I did everything wrong with her. I kept her in a hutch. I didn't feed her correctly. Um, I didn't realize she needed exercise. She lost it to an early death, then devoted her life to teaching others where she went wrong, especially around this time of the year. A lot of people think rabbits are easy pets and good for children, but actually it's not the case. It's how Tracy has come to care for her 14 bunnies, all rescues. They are all been uh, somebody else's bunny that was abandoned. She's found that every year around Easter Sunday, families take in their own bunnies, but quickly realize they can't give them the time and space they need. People think that they can just let them loose, which is not the truth at all. So she urges everyone to think twice before taking a bunny home, because while these rabbits can't be cooped up in a cage, oh, okay. A noodle. They can't survive for long in the wild either without care from a family. Something she and her husband Max are happy to give them. That once you learn to love a bunny, they really are awesome pets. But I just need you to know that it is a lot of work too. Now, with all that in mind, if you are looking to bring home a bunny, Tracy says they're better suited for adults, and she recommends adopting from a rescue or a shelter and avoiding the pet store. In studio tonight, Taylor Graham. KXLY4 News. Thank you so much, Taylor.